So what is up guys and girls, I am Mr. E from NYC and if you are new to the channel, I want to welcome you. In today's video, my journey starts here, Staten Island, New York. We will be working our way to the Staten Island Ferry, taking the ferry into Manhattan and hooking up with the fellas over at Dainuti. Dainese. <laughs> Dainese, make sure that. For a group ride. I am rocking the Onyx RCR. I was at 81 volts. Traveled about 3.7 miles so far to get me towards the Staten Island Ferry. I do not have a charger for today's ride, so I'm hoping I don't regret that decision. But without any further ado, let's get into this one. Let's go! <laughs> it is the inaugural Fall Classic hosted by Electric Wednesday and co-sponsored by S3, 718. 718 Cruisers and NYC Zeus Club and all of our awesome sponsors like Dainese, Powerful Lithium and others. Cantieri. Cantieri Hamburgeria. So we're going to be going on a group ride today. It's going to be multiple stops. We're going to take a nice clean route all the way up 6th Avenue. We're going to go over the Queensboro Bridge into uh, Long Island City. Then we're going to go to Annibal Basin. Beautiful, very nice spot, a place that we've gone for Electric Wednesday many times. It's so gorgeous there. After that, we're going to ride down through Queens into Brooklyn, over the Williamsburg Bridge, and then we're going to hit uh, Cantieri. We're going to have burgers and a beer, a special on them. These guys set that up. Amazing. That's what Electric Wednesday is all about. Out. You gotta come out so you can see all these locations. After party, where's the after, after party? party? At Bobby's Night Out. How I'm so psyched about Bobby's Night Out. I love that place. It's right near where I live. I could get shitty and still like walk the bike oh. home. We are gonna be doing giveaways today. Uh, this ride is gonna be about 15 to 20 miles. Uh, there is very, very, very limited charging. Uh, Provided by the Inez. Would be good. I brought the Chimera. I got like very, very low range on that and I'm ready to run. If you couldn't make it today, don't worry. This is the first of many rides that we're going to be having throughout the year. But this ride, especially, is the first of the year. Uh, it's annual special, so we will have another one next year. If not, just come out to our Electric Wednesday meetups. Yeah, follow That's Electric Wednesday. That's all we ask for. Follow Electric. us on Electric Wednesday. Follow S3 Crew. Follow NYZ Seuss Club and follow 718 Cruisers. Thank you. All right, so we are just about getting ready for this ride to start. Uh, everybody is suiting up.
So how are you liking the ride so far? Good. It's good? This right here is probably my favorite part of the ride. This is Grand Central. This is where uh, movies like I Am Legend were filmed. And John Wick. Check out that view.
mentioned multiple stops along this route and I believe that one of those stops we're coming up to now. This group ride is coming up now and check out that epic view. I ask this pretty much to everybody when I go on a group ride, but I haven't done it in a long time. So I want to start with you. What do you like best about these group rides? Well, you know, honestly, everybody that shows up here, whether you've seen them in a long time or you saw them yesterday, it's always a great time hanging out together. You always give a warm embrace and, you know, every time we get together is an adventure. And today we got to explore a good amount of New York City coming all the way up here. We're now here at a place called Annibal Basin in Long Island City. The view is spectacular. You can't get anything better than this. This is what New York City is all about. We got all these bikes lined up. We're gonna go get a drink. And then after that, we're gonna go have that burger special because I am already Sorry. starving. It's so hot out here. You and me both. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna pick you up on that drink. Okay. Yeah. John? I know how to say the word, Dainese. Uh oh. Dainese. 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 Make sure that. I do this from time to time and I ask people what is it that they enjoy about these group rides. So I haven't done it in a long time. I'm starting out now with y'all. What do you guys enjoy about this group? Ride? I mean, honestly speaking, riding with the bros like my bro Wavy, Andy, you, Mr. E. Come on, you know. It's always love, man. It's always love when we do group rides, man. Always, always love. That's, what's That's up. the main thing I love about it. The love that everybody got with each other. Appreciate it. And we look out for each other as well. That's what's up. Cito signing out. It's all about the community, all about friendship, all about togetherness. All about the getting together and just enjoying the day. It's a gorgeous day out here. Perfect day for a ride. What's up? You know, we've been here before. Yes, we have. Yeah, but honestly, what I love about the group rides is all the bikes, people, you know what I mean, the vibes. I mean, you got ups and downs. At the end of the day, we all still come together. So that's, that's right. what I saw about. It's like one big happy family. You know the vibe already. My brother. Always love. All right, I'm here with Carlos from Arcane Motor. Carlos, I got a quick question for you. Every group ride I ask people, why is it that they ride? And I haven't done that in quite a while, so I'm just curious. Why is it that you ride? Yeah, uh, it's, uh, it's 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 my passion to be out, you know, riding my bikes, whether it's my e-bike, my motorcycles, or my bicycles. I like to be out on two wheels, and especially with uh, good friends and a beautiful day like this. So it's it's really nice to enjoy the day and the last days of summer too. I call it a winning combination. Yes. So it's uh, in the. <laughs> Like I, I was telling this to someone else the other day, I wouldn't come out if the I didn't like or there was such amazing group of people. So that's the number one reason I still come out. You know, because once you get to a certain age, you don't have time to make new friends and be out there. So the, the community, the people, that's the number one reason I come out to these things. And then my hobby of riding and being on two wheels but mainly the people is what makes it enjoyable it's all about the community yes. Cheers. Cheers. all right so on these group rides what i normally do is i approach everybody and i ask them why is it that they ride i have not done that in a long time so i'm trying to get that in now so i'm curious melissa why is it that you ride uh, there's something about a the wind in your face uh, with a bunch of other people who feel the same way love the experience um, and just feeling safety in numbers, that's that's a good one in Manhattan. Um, and just being around people who have the same interests as you. All right, I appreciate that. <laughs> Thanks so much. That's what's up. Normally when I go on these group rides, I ask people, why is it that they ride? But I haven't done it in a long time. So I want to do that in today's video. So I'm curious, guys, why is it that you ride? 
Uh, well, I ride just because it's fun and it's a good way to spend time with my dad. What's up? I like, I, like to, I like to see the city, get to see some new spots, gorgeous weather, be with my son, hang out, chill, and uh, the community's great. All right, that's awesome. Thank you for your time. Appreciate it, appreciate it. Yeah. All right, Taiho, yeah. what I like to do is ask people, why is it that they ride? But I haven't done it in a, in a, in a little while, so I want to include that in today's video. So Taiho, tell me, why is it that you ride? Oh man, you know what? I've been started riding e-bikes for the past two years and let me tell you, it's a stress reliever. Every time I go out there, try to meet new people, new friends, be able to make new friends and that's that's the main purpose of why I ride. Is to meet new friends and be able to ride and have a good time. You know? What's up? <laughs> right, thank you, thank you. So what I like to do, and I haven't done it in a while, is ask people why it is that they ride. <clears throat> so I want to include that into this okay, video. Okay, all right. Johnny Prime, why is it that you ride? Man, there's so many reasons, but I, I think if I had to pick the top two, number one is freedom. I get around this city. It makes a giant city so small. Get around traffic. Just get places that I've never gone to before. Like even here, Animal Basin. I've never been here before. We're in like the sticks of Long Island City. We're going to another sticks of Greenpoint. You can't get you can't get there on public transit. I mean, but you know this. It's so hard to get to those spots. Number two, the community. Guys like you, guys like Carlos, guys like Andy, Mike, just bringing everyone together on such great occasions to celebrate what we do and what we love, and that's it. What's up? All right, thanks for the time. <laughs> All right, Andy, I gotta ask you, is this your plus one? Always, look at this guy. <laughs> Best companion ever, all right? The only thing he loves to do is be in bags, right? Not that one. <laughs> so so who is this, Andy, who is this? That is my wife over there, Nicole. This is not your plus one. Not my plus one, this guy over here. <laughs> See, we had the same answer, the same I answer. I left her alone in the bridge. That goes to show you. We are suiting up and it is time to get out of here. On to the next destination.
to uh, Lower Manhattan would be the Williamsburg Bridge, and that's what we're hitting right now. That shit was great. <laughs> that's it. That's how we do it. All right. So it was seriously tight trying to cross the Williamsburg Bridge, but we made it and we made it safely. Right now, we're just hanging tight and we're waiting for some of the other riders that might have been taking a little bit easier coming coming across that, uh, that bridge. Like the entire crew made it over the bridge safely. Now it's back to the ride. Destination number two, it is called Cantiere. Cheers to another successful group ride, the first uh, NYC Fall Classic. So excited. Thank you all for coming cheers, out. Cheers, cheers. Cheers, everybody. Cheers. I'm calling an Uber. Woo! All right, so the guys from the club hooked us up with a, a discounted meal. We're looking at fries and a burger, and the burger is out of this world. Vinny, thank you so much for having me. Thank you I for appreciate coming. it. Always it was, a pleasure to have you. It was a fun ride, and I look forward to the next one. I can't wait. Peace to you, my I'll brother. See you. End of September 29th. We're doing Coney Island. I am there. I'll see you there. Mikey, now my channel. Peace right. to you, my brother. It was great. Yes. <laughs> you guys put on a, a great show. I look forward to the next one. Yes, Peace it was to you, such my a brother. great day. I'm glad everybody made it safe. Be see safe. The next one. That's right. September 29th, everybody. Yes. All right, so this guy over here, he is late, but I call that fashionably late. <clears throat> he helps make our group rides. So if somebody wants some booming system like this at their group ride, where can they find you? Electrified.lenny.nyc on Instagram. Huge shout out to Electric Wednesday, S3, 718 Cruisers, New York City Zeus. All right, so this is the part of the group ride where I say goodbye. I'm out of time. I am on my way home. It was awesome seeing all the guys again and riding around the streets of NYC. There is another group ride on September 29th. So we will be doing this again. If you enjoyed this video, please don't hesitate and smash that like button. Leave a comment because I get back to everybody. And if you want to, please subscribe. Until the next video. Peace out, everybody. So I am familiar with Razors. And if you guys don't know, this is JB360. JB360 has his own YouTube channel and he's doing an amazing job on YouTube. He has some great content. If you don't already follow him, give him a follow. Uh, he specializes in these builds. Just like this one over here. 
And why don't you just tell me real quickly a little bit about the build that we have. Yeah. I want to know top speed and all the components that you got going on in here. All right, so we got uh, running a FAR driver, 96, uh, 890. 96, really? 96, 890. Uh, we are running 72 volts, uh, 50 amp hours, but this is capable of about 420 amps continuous. Um, we have a 10,000 watt uh, Soshi motor, a hub motor in the back. Um, and this is a frame, the frame is actually an RSF650, so uh, we just basically use that frame, put in new forks, new motor, controller, everything. So, uh, top speed, please. Top speed, I'm gonna say, I think it's 90. I what? Think, yeah. There's no way. Yeah, I yeah. gotta see that. You got proof of that? Yeah, yeah. You know people well, in the comments are gonna be like, yo, that's we hit, we can't hit 90. We hit 86, but because we hit, like, traffic. Yo, even 86 yeah. is fucking, it's that's an amazing, bro. <laughs> that shit is amazing. Yeah, wow, it's 86, but insane. it's actually surprisingly comfortable because you're sitting, like, almost like a chopper style. Right. So my legs are more a little bit forward a, a bit. So yeah. that that was yeah. my next question. Do you yeah. feel safe riding this at those speeds? Oh yeah, yeah. So you do. Surprisingly stable, like considering how small it is. Right. But the I think the big tires, especially the, the rear yeah. tire, makes yeah. up for it. Yes. Um, cool. And yeah, it's, it's fun, man. It's fun to ride. Definitely something different. <laughs> well, it looks amazing. Thank you. Maybe thank one you. day you'll let me take it for a ride. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. Thank you for your time. <laughs>